What's up guys, it's Dope Strings here. I'm here to bring you guys a video, man, for today. Hey, I'm here to tell y'all, man. I'm here to tell y'all, bro. If you didn't enter that giveaway, bro, you just, man, I don't know how y'all, I don't know how y'all be missing out on these giveaways until y'all don't say nothing to the last minute or whatnot. Y'all be missing, y'all be missing a lot of money, I ain't gonna lie. I didn't gave, I didn't gave, um, I didn't gave seven hundred sixty dollars away in one giveaway. Um, the guy won, and all he did was spend twenty bucks on tickets. He, he had he entered when um when I was doing a little deal, um so I was offering like double the tickets or something like that. But he he won like that. I had eight people enter, then um and he he ended up coming out with the um the win. He he spent he spent twenty bucks and won seven hundred sixty dollars. My next giveaway that I just did, that I just launched and I just ended. Um, I paid the winner yesterday. Um, and I'm gonna go live today too. But I paid the winner yesterday. Um, all you had to do was um, go to a Facebook page and comment a goal or like an investment or something you wanna know about or learn about or you're currently in, you're currently doing. That's all you had to do, 100 bucks, easy 100 bucks. I only had one per. Oh, you had to be within the U.S. too. There's a lot of people that entered. They tried to um, add the Facebook page that weren't even in the U.S. Um, the reason you have to be in the U.S. Is, I made a specific reason for why. Um, but yeah, guys, man, the tr I mean, the, the Facebook page is basically. Um, I mean, I guess we can connect with one each other, one another, um, like what what not. But it's basically to freaking um, learn about investments. Um, help, help, give advice to each other. Um, whatnot. Help, help. I'm just basically in the group. I'm just trying to get. We trying to get drivers further along in the career. Um, that way you have drivers that are seasoned drivers, and you're not just just learning, trying to learn something from someone that's, that's not seasoned or someone that doesn't know anything about investing. Um, so basically that's what that group is about. Um, also I want to. I'm trying. I'm trying to do it to the way that we can. Um. That we work together to help drivers out. Like, if let's just say a driver breaks down somewhere, and they need they need help because they don't have all the funds to get the truck towed home. I, I want I want drivers. That's like a, a requirement. You got. Okay. Yeah, I was not expecting that to happen, but. Um. There we go. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry, guys. The phone feel. I was not expecting that to happen. Oh, let me see if I can set this up right here. But yeah, guys, that's like a requirement, man. You got to be willing to help other drivers out, bro. Because um, you never know when you might need help. So I'm trying to put that out there, man. Um, I'm trying to put, I'm trying to, yeah, that's, that's, what, that's basically what the group is about, man. Helping other drivers, um, talking about investment goals. Um, I like talking about this type of stuff because, I mean, it inspired me. So that's basically what the group is centered around. Um, you don't have to pay to join the group or anything, but you got to be willing to help another driver out. Um, what the hell they got going on? You got to be willing to help another driver out or whatnot. But, um, but guys, let's get into this video. This video is about Prime. A lot of drivers, um, they think I should leave Prime. Um, they think I should leave Prime. Um, a lot of drivers in the comment section or whatnot. I mean, they of course they don't. A lot of these people aren't even drivers at Prime, but I think I should leave Prime. Um, they they, bro, people. I had somebody recommend CRST to me, bro. I'm not putting my truck over there at CRST. They don't make the money, bro. They don't make the money. I'm tr trust me, trust me, bro. Trust me. When I say they don't make the money, they don't make the money. Um. As an owner operator at Prime, I average four to five thousand take home per week, every week. We're not talking about um what the hell is what the hell is this guy doing? Why does he got his channels all the way back? Okay, I, I average four to five thousand take home every week. I got I had a week where I, I um recently where I took home thirty one hundred bucks. But on average it's four to five thousand. Thirty one hundred is like an odd week. I mean I can't remember what the hell happened, to be honest. I have to go, you have to look at one of my videos. Where I, I probably spoke about what happened. 
but that's not a normal week for me. 3100 bucks. But even though 3100 is not a normal week for me, 3100 is still a lot of money. Um to a lot to a lot of owner operators out there. That's probably a lot of owner operators are only making 3100 bucks a week. Keep that in mind. A lot of owner operators are only making 3100 bucks per week. Um Oh, he trying to get he trying to get further this way so he ain't got a arm um, so nobody blocking him in in the morning i guess but um yeah guys a lot of drivers are not making four to five thousand per week owner operators take home so why would i leave prime for another company um a lot of arguments about um the drivers at prime can't go faster than like 65 55 or something like that i, I be seeing those comments or whatnot um me personally I don't care that much, to be honest, about the speed limit that we can go. At the end of the day, I care about the money. Um, I, I wouldn't trade. I wouldn't trade off money for speed. That'd be. I mean, to me, I mean, a lot of y'all do that, and I feel like that's dumb as hell. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna call it out like that. I'm gonna call it how I see it. Um, a lot of people do do that. They trade off. They trade off speed for money. Um, money for speed. However you want to call it. They they trade it off. That's got to be the dumbest crap I ever heard, man. I ain't going to lie to y'all. That got to be the dumbest crap I ever heard. People are literally happy that they can go 70, 75 miles per hour, but only take home like two grand a week. Like, come on, bro. Let's be let's be honest, bro. Let's be honest. Um, I'm not, Me personally, I don't care about that crap. Like, y'all can care about all y'all want, but, man, me being over here, man, I don't really care. I ain't going to lie to y'all. Um, A lot of people care about the cameras. I care about the camera. I don't like the camera. I don't want a camera. But at the same time, bro, am I gonna mess up the money just because I don't like something like a camera? Now, if it was something like morally, like wrong, that I felt like was like morally wrong, I would leave it in an instant. Uh, I'm strong on morals and whatnot. But I feel like something just morally wrong, like freaking taking advantage of drivers. Like, I just feel like I gotta leave. Like something like that, bro. I don't believe in that. But something like, um, Something like adding a camera to the trucks. Even though I feel for y'all, man, I don't I don't think I should have a camera in my truck regardless because first first off, I'm an owner operator. Um I had a I had a what the hell? I'm an owner operator. That's crazy. I ain't never seen no one do that. But um I'm an owner operator, bro. I'm an owner operator at Prime. I keep telling people this. I am an owner operator. What the hell is people doing? Oh my God, he is gonna smack them folks hood. Um, I'm an owner operator at Prime. Give me a second, people. I'm just looking at what the hell going on. Oh well, yeah, I'm, a, I'm an owner operator at Prime, so I don't feel like, we shouldn't have cameras, bro. It's not even a Prime truck, bro. It's not a Prime truck. I had somebody comment on one of my videos saying that, um. This is it's a lease purchase truck. It's a prime truck, bro. No, this is this my truck personally that I have right now. This truck that I'm currently in, this is not a prime truck. I'm telling you guys this now. This is not a prime truck, bro. Um, this truck is leased on to prime, but it's not a prime truck. Prime doesn't own this truck. I can take this truck any company I want. Um, and I'm just I'm just gonna make that clear, bro. So when I say what the hell is going on here? When I say I made four to five thousand per week, um, keep in mind I'm an owner operator. I don't pay for a truck. I don't pay a truck payment every single week, like like everybody else. Um, that's leasing a truck right now at Prime or at least purchasing a truck at Prime. I don't make that. I mean, we got a couple lease purchases that um they actually bought that truck out. We don't have to make payments at all. But um, people that lease purchasing trucks at Prime, and people that are leasing trucks at Prime. I'm not. I'm not one of them. I don't make payments every single week anymore. Uh, it was a stepping stone though, where I was making payments every week because I was leasing the truck. I've never done lease purchase. I always lease the truck though, multiple trucks at that. But yeah, I did that. Um, but yeah, I'm not leaving Prime, bro. <laughs> I'm, I'm just. I'm just keep that. Keep. I'm gonna hey, just. I'm gonna just tell y'all this, man. What the hell is he doing? I'm 
I'm trying to figure out this dude kind of back up or did he hit somebody? Because I heard somebody when they honked their horn. Like, did he hit somebody or? Oh, no, he's trying to back up. Bro, did he hit him? Or are you trying to train the guy? Okay, but yeah, I'm not leaving Prime, bro. Um, the money is great. It's four to five thousand per week for me. Um, the speed doesn't bother me like a lot of bothers a lot of other people. I can get over that. It's four to five thousand dollars per week in reefer, which a lot of companies are not paying that to owner operators at in reefer. Let's just be honest, bro. Let's be honest. Um, people say go to Landstar. I seen that comment. Go to Landstar. I haven't seen anybody at Landstar consistently make four to five thousand per week. Nobody. Nobody I talk to um, that I know at Landstar, um, and they're, they're not pulling reefer, they're pulling dry van. But then if I was to pull um, reefer at, at Landstar, I would have to go buy a trailer. So no, that's double the maintenance, which I don't want to pay for. But at least not, at least not right now, but um, I don't want to go buy a trailer though. I'm, I'm trying to buy a house. A trailer is not a house. I can't, I, I could live in the trailer, but I'm down, I don't want to live in the trailer, so no. Um, but the dry van, I'm not, people don't make consistent money over there. Um, they have a lot of issues with brokers or whatnot. I don't have issues with brokers over here at Prime. Um, CR, what the hell is he doing? CRST doesn't make the money that I make. This guy, this guy couldn't figure out how to freaking, how to pull into the, this is, hey, this is what I say. This driver couldn't figure out how to back into a spot, so he decided to pull his truck into the spot. I think he hit this other guy. I think that's why this guy is standing out there by him. This is crazy, bro. This is a crazy, crazy thing going on right now. But yeah, I hope y'all like this video, man, Quality. I, I'm in 4K. I didn't realize I had 4K on this phone, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. I, I ain't realize I had 4K. And I'm, I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about like offering like I offer a lot of free advice already. I'm thinking about like maybe buying a second phone. I need a second phone anyway, but I think about buying a second phone and, and giving out that number to people. But I'm going to charge, bro. I'm going to charge. I'm definitely going to charge. It's going to be like a little sauce, man. A little sauce. I, I give advice. You got my number. You can, you can get, you can, um, I, I might do FaceTime calls or whatnot. Um, text messages. Whatever you feel comfortable with. Whatever you feel comfortable with. But yeah, I'm thinking about doing that, bro. I love talking about this stuff. Why not get paid? Why not get? Why not? I mean, I kind of get paid for it with um with YouTube, but not really. That ain't really no money for real. But um, I'm thinking about like actually like I like talking about this type of stuff, man. I like talking about this stuff. I want to be. I want to talk to people that like talking about this type of stuff, like goals, uh, finances. Uh, what would we say? Goals, finances, investments. I like. I like talking to people that like talk about this type of stuff. Like what, what we like what we doing, man? What we doing? But anyways, guys, man, I'm not leaving Prime. Stop, stop, stop talking about leaving Prime, cause the companies y'all be offering don't be paying nothing, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not going to Mercer. I'm not going to Landstar. Um, Landstar got a, I don't know. I mean, Landstar would be like a second choice from Prime. But they, I don't see the consistent money. People, people over there not they not make they not making us consistent money. Like I done seen YouTube videos of YouTubers. Not making a consistent money like four to five thousand. I mean, they're making like they'll make like three grand a week. Um, other weeks they make it like twenty five or something like that, bro. I don't I don't make that at prime. I make four to five thousand every single week. The one off week where I made thirty one hundred, that was just a one off week. That's not. A, I mean, I don't constantly make three grand per, per week. Like this week, this week I'm back at four thousand. Take on. So keep that in mind, man. Keep that in mind. So no, guys, I'm not leaving prime, bro. At least not right now. If I were to leave Prime, it'll probably be Landstar. But at the same time, Landstar, I don't like the way they do some stuff. Like getting paid on a common data card, that's it's weird. Um I mean I got I got paid on a common data card before, but that was like that was like the beginning of my, my trucking career before I had a business bank account. So I want the money in my business bank account. I don't I don't man you, man, you cause you gotta deposit it from your uh, your common data card and do that so you don't really get you get paid on like maybe a thursday or something you got to deposit it on like a i can't remember how that crap went um but yeah 
But yeah, guys, I'm not I'm not doing that, bro. Y'all can do that if y'all want to. But I'm telling y'all what I make. I've show I've shown you guys what I make. I'm not gonna prove myself any more than I've already done. That's why I showed y'all that you can make this money at Prime. I showed y'all this man. So let's go make this money at Prime. But um, anyways, guys. If, if you like this video, man, just go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, give me a thumbs up, man. Tell me how you like the video, man. I'm about to jump on live and talk to my people, man. And talk to my people, man. Um, gets me on live, bro. I, I might go live. I'm, I might start going live every day, bro. I like talking to other drivers. I like talking about investments. I like talking about goals. I like talking about all this type of stuff. So hit me up on there, man. Hit me up on there. Um, but anyways, guys, I'm about to jump off this and jump on live real quick. Talk to my people for a little second. But anyways, guys, until next time, this is Dope Strings, and this, I'm out with another video, man. Peace.